Can you get it off me? Oh. Okay. Alright. No, dude. No. Stop. Let's see it at all. <laughs> okay. It's really funny. It just sticks when you throw it. I don't like that. I didn't think ah, that's <laughs> creepy. I don't like that at all. Have you seen Jumanji? Uh, the, the OG one? one, yeah. Oh, the new one? No. Oh, so you have two lives left. Oh. oh. All right, guys, we're here today at the Green Belt doing a live vlog review of the Hoka One One Sky Arkali. Is that how you say it? Arkali? Ark? At Carly? Don't correct me in the comment section, I know. But today, we're here to give a live test walk, hike. And as you can see on the B-roll that I'll be playing right now, it's pretty big shoe. It's a pretty giant shoe. I don't think we could consider this a running trail shoe. It's just a hiking trail shoe, which most hikes are on trails, right? Mm -hmm. Yes. I guess if you were doing like a really rugged type of run, it'd be nice because it protects your ankles. Yes. And it's not, it's not super heavy either, so. You could run it. Uh, I think they're a little heavy. But I guess for the amount of like structure you have and protection and cushioning, it's like it's probably adequate, but compared to these babies, what are those? It's got some sketchers. Those things are light. Oh, can't even see That's how fast you are. Things are light. But they're also meant for speed. Hence the word speed. So these are meant for slow. Hence the word slow. I mean sky. Sky a column. Hat. Not sponsored. Oh, and uh, Aspen. It's Aspen. Aspen, what's Aspen? So let's talk about the fit so far. Now, Hoka's typically fit, for me, a little narrow in the toe box and a little long. And right now, I'm thinking, they feel a little long. I am wearing thin socks, so that could be part of it, so don't kill me in the comment section saying, you can't make your foot, it's not it. No, I'm just saying for me. But yeah, a little, a little long. As far as width in the toe box, I had to loosen up the straps a little bit, but you know, you have the option. Megan, how, how does it fit you? Ah! Don't fall off the rock. Um, I think very similar to what you're saying, you know, typical Hoka's fit typically a little bit longer than a lot of other brands. And um, the width feels great to me. They're really comfortable. I like the, the how it grabs around your ankle. I like that secure feeling it's giving me right now, so. I like the straps, bro. The str look at the strap. Right there, that. Ooh, that Velcro. And look at the, the, the back one. Hold on. Don't do it to him. Ooh. Boom. Easy on, or easy off, and back on. What do you think about the. Oh, you don't got them. Ah, you're lame. I got Skechers. We're in the river. Skechers. <laughs> <laughs> <Skechers. laughs> <laughs> I am too. Because apparently I fell once. So, just in case anyone wants to know, there may have been a time that I was here a long time ago. I was young and naive. I tripped, slipped for like a second, got back up. <laughs> if anyone tells you anything different, they're over exaggerating the story. That's all. So, you want to hear the real story? So, the real story is a couple years back, I was, a going, I was going for a run. Going That's for a little run with this guy here. And um, we get to a rocky part. I'm like, hey, Jamie, watch out. Don't trip here, there's a lot of rocks. Five minutes, well, not even five minutes, more like five seconds later, I hear a thump. And I look back at this guy. Curled up on the ground. Oh, now he's running away. Don't trip again. <laughs> Careful, don't trip. Get him, Aspen. Go get him. What's your right? Wrong way. Right. Right. Get him. Really bad at this. Get him. Go get him. Uh, okay. Nope. 
back. We are off the trail. About, in my 43 years of life, I've never been on this bridge. Oh, magical. So we are now on road, not trail. So we're gonna see how the shoe feels on the road and a bike. Oh crap! Oh, it's the bike. It's the biker. The bike is gone. Um, honestly, it feels like a hoka. It's still cushy. Which these shoes are very cushiony. Not like that slappy cushion. They're not like you're falling off the shoe. It's just like there's a compression in there. So I wouldn't call this a fast shoe and because of the way you can't be fast anyway unless you're really really strong. Which I'm not that strong. She might be very strong, but I'm not that strong. So these are gonna be my walking, hiking speed shoes, you know. But we're on concrete, so it's not much of a hike for trails, but the grip of these things are very nice. You get the Vibram outsole, a little different from the Speed Goat 4, but it works just the same, if not better. I haven't slipped a once. Now I wouldn't say it was a slip, it's more just an unbalanced, like me not being coordinated to sit on the rock. So, I fell off. How is the cushioning? It's nice. I like it. I feel good. How about you? What? Any comments? Um, no. Drink a gallon of water per day. Read 10 pages of non-fiction entrepreneurship slash personal development book per day take a progress picture every single day which i probably will only do at least once a week because i don't have that kind of storage um so that's iphone props it. a five minute cold shower a day three critical power list tasks i have to complete there has to be 10 minutes of dedicated visualization every day i don't have time for that uh yeah that's the gist of that one how about i'll make my version of it and i'll send it to you guys to do it What's yours gonna include or disclude? The cold shower thing's out. Yeah. Uh, the meditation thing is gonna be like five minutes before bed. Uh, see, I, I already read before bed, so that one's not gonna be too hard. Is there read a whole book? No, no, no. It just says three ten pages. Okay, that we can. Let's do five. Because sometimes books have small font, and it's like it takes forever to go to the page. I read on my Kindle, so. Oh, Kindle. Ten, ten taps, and I'm, I'll be good. Gen Z Kindle. Mm -hmm. It's a great way to get all the books I want and not have to keep moving pounds and pounds of books around every time I move. What do you think, Megan? Hmm? What side are you on? What side? I didn't hear the conversation. Just say my I'm side. Back here. The dark side. That's racist. <laughs> I think we're on the right Star way. Wars. Oh, we went under that Star Wars. Oh, Star Wars. At this rate, this video will either be a review video or our survival video. Yeah. Because we're against the against the clock right now before the sun sets. All right. Get back to our cars. Should we run in slow motion? I uh, know. Okay. No. I need some slow motion shots. If not you go. No. So. We're lost. Well, we're not totally lost. Like we know which way to go, like direction-wise, but not how to get there specifically. So we're hoping that this is gonna be like getting home. Cause sunsets in like 20 minutes. And sunsets pretty quick. It's like bright and dark. So hopefully we get that before dark. If not, it'll be just us and the hocus. And some sketchers. Oh, 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 okay. Now for my final thoughts on this vlog slash first impressions review. I mean, is it really first impressions, Megan? Because you have this shoe for like two weeks now. Second impressions? Second impressions? Yeah. So let's go to your thoughts first. You'll probably be more positive. Um, I really like the shoe. It's very comfortable. I think it's a, it's a nice hiking shoe. I wouldn't really necessarily run in it on the trails. I think I would prefer something lighter. Um, a little less constricting on my foot um, but you know it's a it's a really nice comfortable hiking shoe and I think you can put a lot of miles in it 
and I think it's going to hold up. On your, you know, you can go on rugged trails because the ankle support is really comfortable. Um, just, I would probably recommend, you know, to try the shoe on and make sure that the sizing fits. You might need to go down a half size. Um, I probably would have gone down a half size. I'm usually a nine, and I think I'd go to an eight and a half. But I like it. All right, and my thoughts are. I guess almost the same, Megan. I feel like we're thinking the same thing. Wow. Um, my foot's a little wide, so I would stay with my size 11. But if your foot's like anywhere near narrow, half size down would not hurt. Cushioning, it's a hoka. It feels good. Grip wise, fantastic. Vibram Mega Grip. I've been saying that. Vibram Mega Grip. It's awesome. Looks wise, I kind of like the way they look. They're nice. They look weird, but they kind of like look cool at the same time. Look at that. Good color waves, too. Yeah, the women's looks better than the guys. No, I like both of them. I like the yellow on yours. Mm. But I like yellow. I like yellow. What it compares to, I don't know. I don't have any hiking shoes. So I guess, therefore, these are keepers because if I ever go hiking, like as in just walking and not jogging or running, then yeah, these would be the ones. So approved, but not like, I'm not like, whoa, this is great. And for one reason only. Two hundo. Two hundred dollars for these shoes. Now, I know boots are expensive like cowboy boots and other hiking boots but it doesn't change i'm still poor therefore i gotta critique it as if i pay for these i didn't pay for these they were sent by hoka thank you hoka but two hundo oh my gosh i'm a youtuber not a lawyer <sighs> nonsense anyway michelle any thoughts so with my sketchers, I only almost rolled my ankle once. Bruh, it's not about sketchers. It's about Hoka. I think y'all look a lot cooler than I do hiking. Y'all look more legit. I think your socks really complement the shoes. There uh, you go. We're good, we're good, thank you. Let me got oh, come on crap. I'm gonna fall. Okay. Anyway, let me try it again. Let me know what you guys think about the shoes. Have you tried them? Are you more like a speed goat person? Would you try these for hiking? Do you run in these? I don't know. Maybe you do. So be sure to subscribe, like, follow us on Instagram. Hey, Michelle, do you want an Instagram uh, shout out or no? Yeah. All right. I'll put all three Instagram. I don't uh, do any running, but hey. But you know about sports. I do. I do know about And injuries. Lots, lots injury about prevention. Injury. injury rehab. So as far as I'm concerned, you're a runner. Or an elite jogger. Like myself. I'll go with the elite jogger. All right, join the club. There's two of us now. Uh, comment down below if you want to join the elite jogging group. As always, be sure to stay in school. Don't do drugs, and if you can, as always, Do keep. Say... <laughs> do ankle rehabs, runners. And keep it tight. Gosh. This is the shoe, shooting in 360p. This is the pooch. Can we say hello? Say hello.